Hi, my name is Miguel from avoiderrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to remote access a Windows 10 PC. To remote access a PC, you will need to create a user with a password or add a password to a current user. Now to do that, head over to Control Panel. Under View By, select Small Icons, User Accounts, Manage Another Account, And here you can add a new user or just select the current user and add a password to that user. Create a password and enter a new password. Once you're done with this, we will need to get the IP address of this PC. Done. Now, on your keyboard, press the Windows key plus R. It'll open the run window and then type CMD to open the command prompt and click OK. Here type IP config, and press enter. It'll provide you with the IP address and default gateway IP. Write it down because we're gonna use it in the future. Once we're done, close the command prompt now right click this PC, Properties. Here click on Remote Settings from the left and check mark on the Remote Desktop Allow Remote Connection to this computer and on check Allow Connections only from computer running Remote Desktop with Network Level authent Authentication. This, this would just complicate things. Now, if you want to add a user, just click on Select Users, click Add. Say you want to add someone other than the administrator, you can add it here. But by default, the administrator is enabled for remote desktop. So I'm going to cancel here. Cancel. And apply the settings. This PC is fully set up for remote desktop connection. Now what we need to do is remote access to that PC from a computer in the network or LAN. That way if we try connecting from the WAN or outside the network, if it gives us any problems we can isolate it to the router's firewall or router. I'll be accessing the Windows 10 remote PC from another Windows 10 within the LAN. All I need to do is click on start, remote, and then click on remote desktop from the results and here type the local IP address which is 10.0.0.10 and connect enter the remote username and password remember my credentials OK now here click on yes done we have successfully remote desktop a Windows 10 PC within the network or LAN now we need to try to remote desktop the same PC from the WAN or outside the network. For this, we will need to configure the router or router firewall to enable port 3389. Now, from that same PC that you're going to remote access, the Windows 10 PC, open Microsoft Edge and here type what is my IP address and it'll provide you with your WAN IP address or you can go to iplocation.net forward slash find IP address just like you see it here. I'll put the link in the description box. And it'll provide you with the WAN IP address. Write it down because we're going to use it in the future. Once done, in Microsoft Edge, enter in the search http colon forward slash forward slash and the gateway IP address to log in to your router. In this case, I don't have a router, I have the ISP modem. It also requires a username and password. Once there, locate port forwarding. It should be somewhere in the firewall in your case. Here, make sure that port forwarding is enabled and add a service. Name the service. I'll name it RDP, Remote Desktop. The server IP address is 10.0.0.10 .0 .0 .10. 
service type, TCP and UDP. And the starting port and ending port is 3389. Once you're done, click on add. Perfect. Now my router is configured to enable a remote desktop through the firewall. Now, instead of using the local IP address, try using the WAN IP address. Once, the, once you're done, click on connect, enter the remote username and password, remember my credentials, and click OK, and you should be able to remote access that PC from outside the network or LAN. Done. Here it is. I have successfully remote that uh, PC from the WAN. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.